the second EU CELAC summit has come to an end in Brussels. The 61 leaders of both blocs released a final declaration in solidarity with Venezuela in rejecting the U.S. blockade on Cuba. The EU signed an agreement with Peru and Colombia on the sidelines of the EU CELAC summit. By the end of this year, citizens of both countries will be able to travel to Europe without a visa. Quito, Ecuador has been witness to violent right-wing protests against the government for the second time this week. The protesters beat up at least one person and threw bottles at the supporters of President Rafael Correa. The Guatemalan Supreme Court said it is now in the hands of Congress to investigate President Otto Perez Molina for corruption. Lawmakers said they would form a commission to decide whether to strip the president of his immunity. The 44th edition of the Copa America will kick off late on Thursday with a much-awaited match between Chile and Ecuador.